Hey guys, what's up? It's Megan and welcome welcome back to my YouTube channel. So in today's video, I'm going to be doing a how to my Instagram pictures. So in the past, whenever I've done these videos, I've used Visco and I have Visco X, which is like the subscription. So you get more filters and editing tools. And I used those in my older videos. Basically, a lot of people that were watching them couldn't really use the video and it wasn't really helpful because... You know, if you just wanted to edit Instagram pictures, it's probably not the best use of your money. But recently, I've actually been doing something different and using a different app, and it's all free. At least what I'm going to show you is all free. And I'm also going to show you how to edit pictures like this, which have become really popular, especially on TikTok. I don't really have any of these on my Instagram, but the way I edit my Instagram pictures is really simple. So I figured I would include this too. Also, if you're interested, I just filmed a What's on my iPhone, and I uploaded that last week if you want to go check it out. But um, so to edit, I've actually been using an app called Prequill. It's free. So I'm going to import this picture, which I uploaded on Instagram recently. And the way I do this, it's so simple, guys. So I go to filters and I go to the selfie section and I click honey. And for this one, I used honey one. And I just turn down the intensity a little bit so that it's not like too edited. But I just really like it because I like the colors that it brings out and I like the warmth and like the grain and all that kind of stuff. That's basically it. Um, I know it's not a lot, but if you want to add like sparkles and stuff, which have become really popular, if you go to bling and you click like bling 2 or something um, and you turn the intensity up to however much you want it, you can just play around with that and turn the filter down. I don't know. I just really like it. This has become really popular. I think I've used bling on one of my Instagram pictures before. But yeah, it literally takes like two seconds it's so simple but now if you guys want to edit pictures like these i'll show you how to do that too so if you go to filters and you click popular miami is the first one so you can turn this up to however much you want um you can just play around with that they have a bunch of different filters on here and if you go back to effects and you go to popular and you click disco you can click these sparkles disco 2 is the most popular one you can turn up the intensity the scale makes them a lot bigger and you can just play around with that now i do still edit some things on visco so this is one of the pictures i just posted it was from a while ago but i just found it and i liked it so um for this what i would do is use c7 which i'm not sure that's a free filter see like this is why I stick to using prequel for this, um, but I mean that it's just what I've been using on my Instagram recently. But so C7, I turn the exposure down a little bit, um, turn the temperature up, along with the white balance, a little bit of saturation, and I'm minus 0.5 of skin tone, and I just played around with that. Fade is up to, and grain is 4.5. Um, but yeah, that's how I edited that one. That's how I do the majority of them. See then for these that I also posted on Instagram recently, I think it's one of my recent posts. Um, I used Visco for it and it's the C7 one that I just told you guys. But yeah, guys, that's it. It's pretty simple. I don't really do a lot. I hope I kept it easy for you guys and it was easy to tell what I was doing. But yeah, if you guys have any questions, leave them down below. That's something else. For some reason, YouTube keeps turning off my comments. And I'll like go in, turn them back on, and then I'll go, like, I'll check the video and it still says that they're off. And it's really bothering me. I don't know if I did something, but I'm going to try to reach out to them and see if, like, there's something wrong because it's really bothering me because you guys can't comment and it's kind of sad. <laughs> but yeah, guys, I hope you all enjoyed and I'll see you next time. Bye, guys.